this is Creative Crush with Erin Tracy. I'm here in Atwater Village, which is one of my favorite neighborhoods in LA, and we're going around and seeing if we can find any creative folks out here in the wild to see what it is they make, and maybe even see if they'll make a little something with me. Creepy wink? Is that too creepy? <laughs> Hi, I'm Erin. I'm here with Darby. Hi. Darby, what do you make? Uh, I'm a filmmaker. Okay. Yeah. What's a, what's your, like, do you have a certain kind of film that you make? Are you like a sci-fi horror yeah. person? Yeah. So I currently make short documentaries and music videos, and I'm right now in pre-production for a short horror film that I'm directing. Awesome. I knew horror film. There's something about <laughs> the, like, sweet strawberry Thank earrings you. that I was like... <laughs> Definitely some bodies in that basement. Can you tell me about your horror film? Yeah, um, it's just basically talking about PTSD within women, kind of talking about sexual assault and being single and being alone with your own mind. That sounds like a horror film, like real <laughs> horror. Do you like have a set of collaborators that you work with all the time or do you have like a changing group of people that you work with? I have like different groups and crews of friends for different things and they're all kind of rotating so I have like a friend who's helping DP this project and he's the one who's really been pushing me to do this and I have people who are just kind of my go-to ride or die gotta have those people right yeah, that you like yeah. trust and love and you're like yeah. I know it'll be good if yeah. they're in the room is there like a goal do you have a bigger picture in mind from what it is you make well I have a lot of experience in trauma and in racism and sexism and I try to tell those stories um, within the context of horror movies and other projects and use my craft to... Do you want me to hold for the truck? Okay, so. Let's ask um, that question again. Yeah, yeah. Do you have a bigger goal or like a bigger picture idea in mind when you're making these projects? Yeah, my bigger picture in mind is just to be able to share my own experiences and stories. Otherwise, documentary stuff, I like to be able to just tell stories of other people who don't normally get the camera shined on them. Awesome. Yeah. Is there anybody that you have a creative crush on that you feel like our viewers should know about? Ooh, someone I have a creative crush on. I have a huge creative crush on one of my best friends, Lindsay Esplin. She's a, she's like an, actually I was just with her and then she walked away, but she wouldn't want to do this because she doesn't like to be on camera at all. And she would hate that I'm saying this about her, but she's a, she's a crafter and a painter and a sculptor and a writer. And we've been doing a lot of projects together and she's really like a mentor to me more than anything. And I look up to her for making all the decisions in my life. Well, thank you so yeah, much for nice. taking the time to talk with us and we'll share all your social media stuff so people can give you a follow oh, and like yeah. check out your work. Sick. Thank you. Sick.